I have made a custom knowledge chatbot with the top YouTube advice from creators like Mr Beast, Rain Rehan, Colin and Samir's interviews, Paddy Galloway, Mark Rober. This chatbot has been a game changer for me. I started uploading videos 15 days ago and I have been getting 12000 views and close to 600 subscribers. I know that's small but this is just a beginning and i've started using this bot only 7 days ago and i have a plan that will make my channel go viral and this is how i'm going to do it my ai automation agents out there you can use this bot to build your influence on youtube you can always service clients like coaches consultants and creators and now imagine having a genius youtube strategist like paddy galloway in your corner guiding you every step of the way about youtube as we have valuable advice here in the platform the problem we are facing is it's not tailored to you but with the power of ai you can get specific advice for your case and that's what i've been doing so let's dive in let's start with preparing our data I am using youtube transcript.com copy the url that we just watched and go to youtube transcript.com paste it here go and you can now copy the transcript and paste it wherever you want if you look at this it doesn't have any punctuation or differentiate who's speaking and when you just copy and paste this one long sentence the model will have a hard time making sense of this data check out my free resources down below for a new method to transform your inputs if you let look at this second half of the document it has punctuations and it's easier for llm to figure out that there are two speakers that way when we ask a question it has the context so let's set up let's go to voice for our tutorial today free version is enough as a bonus i will show you how to integrate voice flow with flowwise ai as well let's go to stack ai click on new project i already have mine prepared we have input and output we have a document loader input and output you can get them from here for llm this is where you get llm it's all drag and drop data loaders use documents these embeddings are found in the vector stores and this document that i have used is from paddy galloway's breakdowns of famous youtubers and the next step is connecting everything input input to basic embeddings document loader to embeddings as well embeddings will go to open ai open ai to output and that is for the document loader we have chunk size and chunk overlap we are basically breaking down this big 32 page document into small pieces and the embeddings and the vector stores um the vector store stores this data and for the input i have have this question suggest a few algorithm beating ideas and for when it comes to embedding settings we have result length uh, which is in characters and the embeddings we are using text embeddings let's see how we can set the prompt in our open ai mod for this part i'm using a role prompt basically what it's doing is we are setting the role asking ai to use the knowledge base as the context don't over explain the context here is the whole document that we provided and the question is our input and the answer will be provided by our open ai model deploy it and hit play i've changed the prompt so we should see an updated output right now great we have an answer mind you this is not tailored to my channel just yet now we are getting a generic response still it it gives so much value because we are referring to over 32 pages and that's a lot 
of videos if you are running into errors you need to tweak a little bit of settings whether it's model or temperature or max length to get rid of that error you cannot export ui on a free version you can either pay or let's use this deployment and go to voice flow you can deploy this export ui and chat with your bot but if you want to sell this to a client or integrate it into a places like whatsapp we need either bot press or voice flow so for this example we are using voice flow let's start by creating a new assistant select web chat you can give whatever name you want if you are getting value hit that like button and subscribe to my channel to learn more about ai automation agencies you need to select the channel let's say web chat and the language english this is not relevant for us so let's clear out everything we'll have the start node hit this plus sign and drag it once you let go of the click a new node will be created i'll select the text card this will be our welcome text and let's add a capture card this will be listening for users response this is how you create a new variable to catch that response i say i hit create variable and let's say question then drag it here to make a new node select dev api this is where we connect stack ai i have already made my flow i won't be doing it again so let me open mine for the question i said ask me anything about growing your youtube channel and for the capture instead of last utterance i changed it to question the variable that we just created and if you see this block the post block this is the url that i copied from stack ai you can see this right here you need to copy this url and paste it in your voice flow and in the same way we have the authorization which is the bearer and content type will be application json so the headers i will be creating two headers authorization and content type where you can do it by hitting the plus sign like this authorization and you enter that and content type application json so that's how you do it and for the parameters you see raw here it is the input from the input to the stack ai is the question that we are giving this is output out zero in zero is the input and out zero is the output so we come back and set the output here in voice flow now let's see how to connect this to flowwise ai if you don't want that skip to stack ai continuation in the time codes below if you want to learn how to build a bot a custom chatbot on flowwise ai i already have a video on that make sure you watch it and then follow this step i won't be covering them here once you save your flow and it's working click on this little code icon and click on javascript here we see all the required parameters and urls you need to select authentication from this drop down to get the bearer token that we saw earlier and the content type is application json and in the place of in zero and out zero we have query and response if you have any questions you can talk to me on discord so back to stack ai once we finish entering these details in the node if it's a success let's display the answer and if it fails let's say there is an error please try again done and after the answer let's start a loop do you have any further questions if the answer is yes we start from the beginning if not we can end the flow you will end the flow using logic i so let's test it hit on this play icon and 
Who are you? I'm Paddy Calloway. Nice. Do you have any further questions? Yes. How do I go viral? Perfect. Again, this is from the data that has not been processed yet and the prompt itself is really generic. Even for you, this once you have that process data and tweak the prompt to your specific channel, the responses you get are unbelievable. I want to really test this power of AI persona chatbots and grow my YouTube channel to a new level. I will keep you posted on my progress. So stay tuned for that. If you want to learn how to build an AI chatbot with lead capturing and automation capabilities, watch this video next.